Hi there, and welcome to today's event. Today we're going to look at Chat GPT. Yes, again, because I've been asked a question. Uh, how do I share the prompts? Because in one of my videos, it indicated that I could share the prompts. So this is an opportunity for me to go back and find out how I do things. Uh, which is uh, a great way to relearn and share some of the features that I take for granted. And nothing should be taken for granted, right? So thank you for asking the question. I'm going to start a new chat. Notice this is a new chat. I'm going to start with a prompt. Um, let me think of a prompt. So I've been doing web quests lately. So I would like an example of a an introduction to a web quest web quest on um citing uh chat gpt apa style Let's see what i get for that Okay, so here it goes. Notice it's coming up. All right, so here we are. Lots of information about investigating renewable energy, which is not what I asked for. Didn't I ask? Let's look at the prompting. An example of an introduction to a web course citing chat GPT APA style. It's an example of uh, integrating renewable energy according to, okay, so citing chat GPT. That's interesting. Not what I thought, but that is definitely interesting. Now, let me share the prompt. Now that was on Safari. Now I'm going to go into my account on Chrome. So I'm going to log in. If you don't have an account, get an account and get the Chrome extent. I'm going to go into my last prompt. There we are, which is right here. I also had one before that, so I could go into that one. That's the original. So notice uh, the original prompt was an example. I didn't do a good job at it because of the results. And you can see that. An example of an introduction to a web course citing. Okay. And that wasn't, this part wasn't very clear citing APA. It did cite APA style, but the topic was not. So uh, I could uh, change that and revise it, refine it. So I could do that. So it's actually an example. Okay, let me take that again. So I'm going to copy the prompt. Okay, an example. There we go. Let me add it at the bottom. So I'm looking for an example of an introduction to a web quest on chat GP on chat GP um, on chat GPT in general. Okay. And how to cite using APA style. So let's see what that gives me. So, you know, I think this is really wonderful for us to share. And that's why Google Chrome is the way to go. Not that I'm promoting Chrome because I'm on a Mac. And for me, Safari is a lot better and faster. But nonetheless, um, notice that here you can share your prompts. And that's important because if we share our prompts, we'll get better results. By the way, even if you do share your prompt, you don't always get the same results. So keep that in mind. So uh, here it is, um, an introduction. And um, notice uh, the purpose of the web quest. And then, of course, uh, there's a reference cited using ChatGPT. So for your question, use Google Chrome if you want to share the prompts. And the way to share it is to simply click on it. And then uh, notice uh, you can have your topic here. And hopefully, maybe it will give you the same results. Okay, so you can have notice full conversation. The topic, in this case, um, notice what's here. Okay, and you have to choose from this. Not really a great way 
for me in any case because it doesn't really provide me with what I'm looking for. Uh, because uh, sometimes, as you've noticed, education is not part of it. So maybe I can just write down uh, instead of that uh, creative. <laughs> All right. So that's not the topic. And the tags. Now here I can add tags, please. So in this case, I can add WebQuest. Okay, is one tag. And then um, chat. GPT and then citation cite APA style all right that's some of it and then the author's name buy me a coffee right the author's name of course um, in this case it would be me because not that I'm chat GPT, but I did come up with a prompt. So um, again, we're going to share the prompt by clicking on share prompt. And we get this. We had this before. So we're simply going to continue it. So we've added our tags, uh, author URL. I guess uh, we could add our name here by sharing it. Next, I'm going to save it. So I've got everything here. I'm going to click on the save prompt over here. Click on it and notice where it goes. I shared the prompt successfully. The prompt goes to the prompt page. Let me show you where that is. All right, so uh, prompt templates. You notice here the prompts and the latest prompts over here. It's coming up. So this is where it goes. It goes to what's called data fit. And then if you want to find yours and you're not top here, notice 500, 400, sorry. Um, then you just write down your topic. Mine was WebQuest. And then click on it. And here it comes. Renewable Energy WebQuest. That's the title that I had. There is my name. And notice these are the tags that I've added. And so far nobody has uh, responded or to it. So I'm going to share this in the description of this video so that you can view it. And that's it. That's where it appears. It appears under the community. And this is, of course, also an extension on Chrome because notice what it says here. It does say extension right at the top there. Enjoy. Notice the uh, things on the left here. Take a look, explore, and let me know what you think. Have a great day and enjoy. Chat GPT.